What's this shrine for? Oh. I'm doing good. Let's see. Oh! <laughs> Hi, Loon. <laughs> why are you streaming right now? <laughs> Wait. What, why are you... <laughs> why are you streaming those emotes? Sadness, my... Huh? I'm confuzzled. What? So that's one that's what that one is. Okay. I have sadness hours right now. Why you have sadness hours? What's wrong? The holy crusade to which brave warriors flock twice a year. You're not confused. I know where you've been. <laughs> Dep oh, depression. Oh. Did anything specifically trigger it, or do you not want to talk about it? <laughs> They're not. I swear. The crimson angel of Judica descends upon a sacred ground. What will he find there? The laurel crown of glory, or the thorn circlet of despair? What will the fallen angel find through the guidance of the golden apostle? Please enter your name. It is always the same. It would never be any different. Do you know why I'm sad right now? I'll find out later. Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> Luna. I mean, like... It's a valid reason, though. <laughs> and we're all supportive of you. Yep. Is that a phone call so early in? Yes, it is. Pardon me. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> yes, Boko Choco is okay. Again. I've lost again. <laughs> Why? Why is the beauty of my craft not recognized? Why? Hello, Taco. How you doing? Luna, did you? Oh my god, did you leave you? Did, are you... Did you do it again, Luna? <laughs> I'm gonna go, I'm sorry. Oh, you don't have to apologize. Depression is out of your control, so it's totally fine if you're sad. How you doing, Taco? I know I played with you earlier on DVD, but how are you doing? Ah. 
His research holds no beauty. Mere reason is not enough. All is meaningless without the sense of an artistic soul. So then why? Why does this happen? Good, still tired, but better than earlier. <laughs> How many hours of sleep did you get? Those games were great. I'm glad to just joking around and kill your friends here too. <laughs> I saw your killer games. They were just not good. You got some toxic survivors in there. You nap for like one taco. That's not much sleep at all. <laughs> well, I'm still watching you play the. <laughs> oh my gosh, Luna, you left yourself streaming again. <laughs> Why does this happen? No, if I remain here, my genius will only rot. I cannot allow such a loss to the world. I played some killer games just a little bit ago and I was struggling not to kill everyone to get a no ed challenge and I was like, why can't I do this on stream? Because the time you stream is when all the toxic players come out. It is when all the streamers come out. <laughs> so you're you're gonna get those uh tea bagging survivors that are communicating with each other <laughs> twenty four seven on your stream. I am done here. I shall find a place where I am Aww, valued for what I am. Like me. <laughs> Hello again, Luna. <laughs> did you did you actually end your stream this time? <laughs> I shall not return here. I am the party. Yes, you are, Panda. You are the party in a can. Thank you for the lurk wit. <laughs> yes, you did. Okay. Oh, wow. It's raining loud. <laughs> Panda is the party. <laughs> now that Panda's here, we can turn. <laughs> I've come carrying all the raid weapons since Luna left the be Oh, <laughs> Panda. <laughs> I'm sure Luna didn't realize. This affront will not be forgotten. I will have my revenge one day. Consider it punishment for your lack of imagination. I'm not doing that laughter. Remember, then, my name. Unlike you, I have pride in the name I carry. <laughs> Okay, Taco. Take care. Good luck on the stuff you're working with. <laughs> okay, Vanda. Make sure you're squeaky clean. <laughs> Maybe. Oh my god, Panda, I swear. <laughs> You will not find me using some ridiculous alias. I am Tori. Nishi Koji Tori. Ah. Ha. Ah. No. No. Ho. Oh. My ears. Ho. Oh. Take care and come back like I would. Maybe save. Because those ears. <laughs> oh my god. Listen with this library. 
Why can't a big name school at least shell out for some decent heating? If you have the energy to be shouting at the bookshelves, you should try writing a petition. Oh, sorry. Was I bothering you? Yes. I can't read with you making so much noise next to me. Nothing goes into my head. Please forgive my dreadful sin. Bad language is supposed to have effects on the spiritual world. The cold doesn't bother you, Nageki? It doesn't. I feel fine. I see. Having plumage must really make a difference. Maybe they don't bother with heating because of all the birds are fine. Why should I keep streaming my old stuff when this is so new? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I don't think that's the case. So birds are cold in here too then? Well, there's one freezing to death right over there. What? I follow Nageki's gaze and I see a familiar, <laughs> a rather familiar looking bleeding heart dove freezing to death on the floor. Engho, are you alive? Speak to me. Oh boy, here we go. Is that you, Adele Blau? Where is this? Have I fallen once more into an internal prison of ice? No, the AC is just on. <laughs> Who's freezing to death? It's me. Oh shit. <laughs> How are you freezing to death? <laughs> no, look around yourself. It's just an unreasonably cold library. Do you mean to keep my fallen wings in this world, El Plow? If you are to walk with me the blood-stained path of conquest, I... I don't care about that. Why are you on the verge of death in here? The day of judgment draws near. I speak of Ragnarok and blah. He's incomprehensible as always. It's from all the central air conditioning and <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, Luna. The desk he was sitting at is covered in sheets of paper. Oh. Are you drawing manga? Break prognostications of the future. And epics of- I can never take this bird seriously. Like, I- I can't. I'm sorry, I just can't take this bird seriously. And epics of heroes long dead. I must complete them and bring them to the battlefield of gods. It is a lonely, lonely battle. You're, you're just drawing manga, though. <laughs> you're, you take me seriously. <laughs> oh my god. Let's see. He's in the manga club, so maybe he's working on a club scene? Even though the festival was ages ago, how admirable. You can do it, Angha. I'm sure you'll make it on time. But it's cold in here. Don't you think you should go home and work on it there? Do you worry for my flesh? Very well. Perhaps now is a time for repose, as you say. Farewell, Hello Blau. He heavily gathers up his papers and exits the library. He comes in here quite often. Though he would be better off working elsewhere if the cold bothers him so. He must have some reason. Maybe the atmosphere in here gets him into the perfect mindset for the story he's telling. The bleeding heart doves are from the Philippines, so they don't fare well in the cold. He shouldn't push himself so hard. I'm making chicken strips one- <laughs> Oh my god. No, you can have them all, Luna. <laughs> Later that evening... I'm going numb. I should have bro bought that blanket rope. 
Are we talking about a Snuggie? I've had my eye on when I was in town today. The prize will make my purse weep, but this cold makes me weep more. Huh? Someone text me? Um, it's right though. Meet me in town. I wonder what's going on. Okay, I'll take him. <laughs> Doesn't matter. My body is rapidly approaching its crystallization point, so I'll head into town and avail myself of this wearable blanket on my way to meet Reuter. Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh no, I just got here. Um, Choco. I know it's cold, but are you sure you want to be walking around in public looking like that? Huh? But it's a wearable blanket. Wouldn't it be more strange to not wear it? Well, I guess that's true. If you're okay with it. Anyway, you wanted to talk to me. Oh, yes. I wanted to ask you a favor. You hardly ever ask for my help. I'll do whatever it is with Flash. And to ask. So what is it? Do you have plans for the end of the year? Not really. I forced stopped my stream just in case. Oh my god. I, <laughs> I mean, if if that's what works for you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I mean, at least you avoided uh, it much sooner than last time, so. <laughs> because Panda was here. You, you, you did everything, yes. You, you took every precaution to make sure. I finished cleaning and everything. Even New Year's Eve. I was planning to laze around all day, like always. Would you maybe be willing to be a sales girl for a day? There's no pay, but... A volunteer sales girl? Is it at the flea market or something? Even though I'm drunk- How much have you drunk, Luna? Hmm? How many? Okay. That's not far off. Do you know about Common Cat? I drank the whole pack. Oh my god. The whole 12 pack? <laughs> Comic cat? How should I explain it? It's like a flea market, but not. A lot of birds get together and buy and sell manga. They've drawn with their friends. So, sort of like the manga's club's booth at the festival? Yeah, something like that just on a much larger scale. I was wondering if you could run a booth for me. Would you like to? Sure. It sounds like fun. Did you draw something right now? No, no. I'm just not a sales girl. What does that mean? So one of your friends asked you to find someone? I didn't send zero because I wanted. It's the whole 12 pack, okay? <laughs> oh my god, Luna. I I fear for your stomach. I I really do. <laughs> like, I really do fear for it. Yeah, Anha. What? Oh, so the manga he was pouring his life blood into in the library is for this comic cat thing? But why are you asking me? He never mentioned it to me. I've been a sales girl for one group for the past three years, and somehow I found out. 
so... Texorus Melodia Furnus. <laughs> the battle of gods, the judgment draws near. My soul has not the strength left to continue on alone. Become my light. Look, I'm just being- I, I know you are, Luna. I know you are being real, but like, I- I- Like, real talk, I feel bad for your stomach. <laughs> you like... Try- try to be careful. <laughs> it, I could have said only two things got the, Oh my god. He asked me to help him. That means... I'll be lonely on my own? So come with me. I think so, yeah. But I'm already helping someone. I can't be in two places at once. So you're asking me? Yep. What do you say? Want to? Of course. It could be a good learning experience. A learning experience. Well, you certainly see some things you wouldn't anywhere else. It is Ragnarok after all. I think any name Angel comes up with is going to be confusing, but it does look like a battle to end all battles at times. I'll need a weapon, right? Just tell me what to bring. Will I want something with range or will I be up close? Don't take it that literal. I just meant there can be a lot of really impatient birds with no social skills. Okay, Luna. <laughs> it can be confusing at first, so you should probably do some research ahead of time. If you search around, you'll find plenty of guides for first-timers. Kankit lasts three days, and I think Angel's on the third day. The last day is always the worst, so make sure you're ready. Okay, I'll study hard. A sales girl at Comic Con. I have no idea what this one entail. But from what Royton said, it may well be a hell on this earth. My blood thirst is for combat. Time to go home and scour the internet for Comic Cat tutorials. Is that a thing? Is there actually like a tutorial for that? <laughs> Today is the 31st. I am up at dawn, so I may meet the lonely, I mean, the brave Angel who throws himself into the fray of the holy war. It's just. Oh my god, it's, it's not a holy war. What a crowd. Is everybody here going to come and hit? Correct, Adele Blau. Oh, Angel. See you? The holy land of the chosen, the abyss of madness. Tokyo big sight. So that's the big sight. It's an even more bizarre building than my investigations had led me to believe. Let's go inside and huh? It's cold out here. Be not in haste, Adabla. The time is not yet come. Wait for the nightmare sage. Who's who's the nightmare sage? Who shall guide us? Who? Where? Does he have a second helper? Good morning. Chilly out, isn't it? Ah, our teacher. How about showing the birds who's boss? <laughs> oh my god. Mr. Nanaki. We have awaited you, Sage of Nightmares. So wait, he calls him Sage of Nightmares because he's always sleeping, right? That's what I'm getting here. Why are you here, sir? The manga club's advisor asked me to look after Higure. So, you're standing. I suppose he's busy with winter cleaning and everything. No, no. The advisor's here too. He's here, but he wants you to be in health chaperone? Yes. That's right. Apparently, he's busy. He said he's helping at a company booth. A company booth. I feel on the internet said those can end up swamp 
from the start of the convention until closing time. Each bird must do battle with himself in this holy land. I do not blame him. How mature. It looks like I'll be selling Angel's manga with Mr. Nanaki all day. Better do my best. This tea better cool down. Yeah, I'm not gonna burn my lip on that. <laughs> That's piping hot. It was pretty crowded outside, but if anything, it's even worse in here. I haven't eaten all day. Oh my god, Luna. Oh my god. Luna. Go eat! <laughs> Like, go eat! I'm a little worried that some birdie's tender foot or wing bone might get broken with this many birds crowded together. What kind of manga did you draw, Nahel? The Tales of the Dark Angel. The Forbidden Epic Saga. Oh, sounds pretty goth. Oh, thank you for the Dorito. Oh my god, Luna. Let me try to take a sip of this tea first. <laughs> oh, that's bitter. <laughs> How's uh, your test going, Samantha? <laughs> I still have the rice going and chicken is going. Okay, Luna. As long as it's not like just chicken donkeys that you're eating. <laughs> Shit. Oh my god, Luna. Hmm. <laughs> yes. Looks nice. Very like you. I studied a lot to prepare for today. I'll show these. Idol leaders, my super sales girl moves. Let us ride to battle side by side at the Oblau, as dictated by the contract of old. More questions, but I'm suffering. I mean, I'm fine. It's going. <laughs> no one likes the <laughs> end where you have to do all those tests. Um, what should I do? Time is passing warmly by. The epic poem of the Dark Angel is stacked on the table exactly as we placed it when we set up. Um, and how? Should I maybe use my voice a little, like they do in markets? It is, well, a dove loud. Needless effort will only raise more barriers before us. Choco heard enough of it's fine from my stream. <laughs> too, too much fines. If it's not fine, it's okay to say it's not fine. <laughs> Don't give me the I'm fine if you're not fine. <laughs> okay. Do we understand? <laughs> Good, we understand. <laughs> Okay. It's rather chilly in here. Why don't I get us something warm? Oh yes, please. More dots. What kind of expression should I have right now? You see a bird float by on clicking feet. The far wall is lined with enormous cues. Those must be for the big circles. Some of them have even started packing up. Have they sold out already? Just how many books were in those stacked up boxes? It's like looking into another world. Choco. <laughs> pretty core? You know pretty core too? Yes, I do. 
I told Cat's pretty cool. Oh, it's Precure. <laughs> it's Precure. <laughs> He's cosplaying from Precure. <laughs> I want this for to cook quicker. That's the mood. When you're hungry and you just put food in, you just want this to like cook so quick so you can just eat it already. <laughs> yep. He's cosplaying from Precure. <laughs> It's the one that's on Sunday mornings, right? You're so cute. Can you do that thing? The signature line? Uh, it's embarrassing. Just once? I just want to see it once. Um, okay. A single flower blooming in the Afsalt Road. Core gray. Yes, yes. That's so cute. Just like in the anime. <laughs> I'm just wearing it because I was helping out today. Do sales girls cosplay? Sometimes. Not every birdie does. But they always tell me to make sure I come in costume. Circle I'm with just sold out. We're clearing up now, so I better go back and help. Good luck, Choco. Core Grey. Uh, Roy has tried gallantly off with some sales slips and duct tape. Ah, the aura of an old veteran hangs about his shoulders. I've never seen Roita looking so competent. It's almost closing time. And Hale remains silent, looking mildly tortured. I didn't realize sales girls were supposed to cost a Yang Hao. Next time I'll pour my <laughs> tribal blood into a costume. Do not blame yourself, uh Blau. The sin is mine alone. Excuse you, car. Thank you. <laughs> Don't say that. You did your best, Ang Hao. And on your sin. I am cursed with my black ass. That is my punishment. The unescapable cross I must. Excuse me, which of you is representing the circle? A rather gaudily upholstered bird appears before us. Colorful. He's a golden pheasant. A pheasant like the doctor and myself, you know. Angel loves their blood bath. <laughs> he does seem to, yes. <laughs> I never have thought something with such extreme plumage was related to them. I am sovereign of this domain. And you are? Ah, it's you. I thought as much. You're burying. Your countenance. So artistic. I can feel your aura. So unlike any other here. He certainly is unlike any other, yes. Forgive me, I haven't introduced myself. Miss, oh my god, his name. Is going to kill me. Mr. Bishiki Koji Toshiki Nishiki Koji Tori. <laughs> Not, I might add, a pen name. <laughs> I never thought they would just leave after one bad choice. <laughs> they got marriage paper. <laughs> It has been mine since hatching. I am rather proud of it. It is a good name, yes? And the next time you get it wrong, I will make you wish you had never crawled your miserable way into this world. Okay. Tori. <laughs> to go flexing her reading skin. <laughs> oh. Dear me, what am I saying? Please, pay it no mind. Golden Weekly. That's the new Splash Hit magazine. So you know of it? I am flattered. I am the editor-in-chief, and I am here looking for new talent. She never accepted mine, but that's fine. <laughs> Maybe she can't. Oh my god. 
I know not of what you speak of, Luna. <laughs> I notice you from far away. Ah, your unparalleled artistry. Your vast imagination. Yes, these are the attributes of one who will change the world. Golden winged messenger, could you be the one written of in the crimson tone of Augury? You know what I said earlier. Hmm. No. Let's see, I see here, An Angel likes their bloody pass. You never thought they would leave out their one bad choice. And then I just see Panda coming out, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't see anything else, yeah, no. Mm, don't see it. <laughs> Precisely, I am here to aid you. There is yet much talent that sleeps within you. Is it not so? A great power locked within. Yes, exactly. I am here to tell you that I can help you wake your powers. Okay, I'll reiterate, you have the option. Open. It's right there. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, Lisa. <laughs> what option? <laughs> My eyes are closed. I can't see. <laughs> I don't know either, apparently. <laughs> oh my god, Luna. <laughs> but it's there. <laughs> okay, Luna. My firm's location is shown on the back of his card. Please come talk to me in the new year, Anghel, sir. I thank you, Golden Winged Messenger. Let us enter a pact of blood. Wow, Anghel looks so happy. He's grinning. How does a bird grin? Please, explain. I guess he has a pretty worldly side to him, too. <laughs> I'm laughing too hard. Why are you- <laughs> Why are you laughing? What's so funny? <laughs> Imagine a world painted with your ability. Ah, how I long to see it. I shall take my leave now. I pray your new year will be abundant with artistry. Because it's at way, it's great. Oh my god. The golden pheasant walks smartly off through the crowd. What impressive coloration. Oh, she's gonna get the <laughs> she's gonna get the name wrong again. <laughs> Mr. Bishi Kikoji was a very strange fellow, wasn't he? Nishiki Koji, Boko. It's a confusing name. You're so sharp, you'll cut yourself one of these days, Mr. Nanaki. Hmm, then again. <laughs> what is that emote? Is that a heart? <laughs> She's like, no, but I'm like, why not? Oh my god. <laughs> Mr. Nanaki looks Angel up and down and then tilts his head, staring off after the golden pheasant. I don't know very much about manga, but... Hmm. Maybe I'm worrying too much. He looks like he wants to say something, but falls silent. I'm a little worried too. But I can't say anything in front of Anghel like this. Didn't someone once say that a serpent speaks with a silver tongue? And Mr. Nishiki Koji was very suspicious. I hope he was just a normal editor here to scout talent. Hmm. Anghel, none of us mentioned your name to him, did we? Hey, Yuri, how- Hmm. You know, Luna? 
You really like those, don't you? I even added a new redemption and you still redeemed that. <laughs> How you doing, Yuri? Chan okay, you want to change my model. Let me just skip that up. Which, except this one, not the first one, you can't read the first one. Which one of these would you like? I don't know which one, which one? Which, which one do you want? <laughs> Come on, all of them are good? Okay. <laughs> well, we'll go. Would you like the Winged Menace? Since we're playing a bird game. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, you just woke up, Yuri. <laughs> Did you scream late again? She says because she knows what I like. Okay, we're going with Winged Menace then. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> We now have bats on our boobs. Thanks, Aluna. <laughs> the mysterious pheasant in the convention hall crowd. Who is he really? And so they left the Holy Land, Anghel full of zeal, Kazuki and Toko full of doubt. Oh my god. The first day of school in autumn is always a little slow, but the first day after winter break is painful in its own special way. I don't like winter mornings, but being with every birdie is fun, so there's nothing really wrong with school itself. Why you gotta make me lose while I'm making stuff to eat? Oh wait, I did that. <laughs> You're always making yourself lose you. <laughs> oh my god. Huh? Isn't that? Good morning, Angel. Is it you, Edo Blau? You're here on honor student time. Do you go to bed early? The twilight invades my crimson breasts. I cannot expose my flesh to it for long. And that means you go to bed early, right? When do you usually sleep? Before the blue tinted moon leads its ghouls through the night. 10 p.m. <laughs> That's early. That's really early. I am bound to meet the golden winged messenger on this day. He wishes to gather for me the Vorpal Souls. Vorpal Souls? And it exposes themselves to <laughs> Orny. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> That's a new one. I would take him a while to explain if I ask, so I think I'll leave it alone. <laughs> That's the Golden Weekly thing, right? So you're going to meet with Mr. Nishikoji. It is so. And I shall gain new powers. Hmm. Mr. Nishikikoji. That mysterious golden pheasant who appeared before us on the holy battlefield on New Year's Eve. Is he really trustworthy? He seemed highly suspicious. Aren't you nervous, Angel? Could I go with you? Be at ease, hello, Blau. Toko saw me being wholesome last night and she loves me. 
Yes, wholesome is also good. <laughs> wholesome is also good. <laughs> but I feel like if you had to be too wholesome, you might explode. <laughs> Though. Some battles must be fought alone. This is a trial that those born under the demonic scarlet eye cannot escape. Is that so? Well, if you say so, let me know if I can help you. I did explode last night from. Oh my god. I swear. Anger marches triumphantly into his classroom. I bet his bag is full of manga manuscripts. Now that I think about it, he is going to show his work to an editor. It wouldn't be a little odd for a classmate to tag along. I am worried about Mr. Nishiki Koji, but it looks like he is the editor of a real magazine. I can sit this one out. Oh god, the tea is better. Some days later... I was thinking of eating in the cafeteria today. Like you always do. Want to go together? I love to. Even if it was another VTuber. You still were the main attra- Oh my god. <laughs> I swear we <I'm> not. <laughs> that other VTuber is on right now. <laughs> And I'm keeping an eye on if I can raid her later or not. <laughs> I love to. Oko-san's stomach calls for food. Let's go, let's go. So do be- <laughs> Where am I <laughs> Oh my god. Oh god, Luna. Want to come with us, Sakuya? Do you tell me to sit at the same table as commoners? Today's when the second winter menu goes up, and the mixed bean, sukiyaki udon, is really good. It is superb and available only for a few weeks. You can't possibly attend St. Pigeon Nation and never have this sukiyaki udon. Is it truly a food of such great prestige? Yes. And who doesn't think noble when they hear sukiyaki? I don't. Yes, Bert. Choco is the best choice. I would not- Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, Luna. Noble means sukiyaki, and sukiyaki means noble. Hmm. So it is a high class dish here in Japan. Not really, it's actually more fast food in comparison to their higher class stuff. <laughs> I suppose if all this is so, there cannot be much harm in trying it. Yeah, let's hurry before they're out. Is sukiyaki really something aristocrats used to eat? No, not really. <laughs> All I want is choco soup. Oh my god, Luna. Go to the corner and bonk yourself. <laughs> You're gonna go and make me freaking make a 13th floor in Horny Jail. Mm. The mint bean sukiyaki udon here is the best. Here, let me give you some of the meat from mine. If you want it. Are you sure? If I eat all of it, I'll feel sick later. Oh, right. In that case, you can have some of my beans. Here. So this is sukiyaki. I wonder at the undignified flavor, but it is not bad. <laughs> oh my god. It's good. Son, be careful. If you keep swallowing them a hole like that, you'll choke. It would be kind of odd to ask for it in summer, but it is a little lonely only being able to eat it in January. Maybe the fact that it's seasonal makes us think it tastes better than it really does. I mean, no, sukiyaki actually does taste good. 
tell me again how she is amazing birds. Oh my god. <laughs> that was good. Uh huh. A familiar figure appears by the tableware return area. The famous eccentric Filipino banana boy. Angha, I don't usually see you here. Oh, it's you, little blow. His reply comes somewhat slowly. Are you okay? You don't seem as energetic as usual. Oh, don't tell me Mr. Nishiki Koji said something nasty to you. It's okay. Don't worry, Angel. You're still in high school. If you keep working like you have been, you'll be a pro in no time. And that'll show him. Do not be anxious, Elodlau. The golden ringed messenger shall guide me on the path to glory. I'll ask for it every season. Oh my god, Luna. <laughs> the stars travel the paths they must. I wish I could say the same to Corgi, but Choco would be ch Oh my god. <laughs> if you go shrimping for Corgi, you're shrimping for yourself, because you both act alike. <laughs> <laughs> he walks away grinning happily how does a bird grin I'm glad things went well with Mr. Nishiki Koji but he looked a little pale didn't he so you think so too and I've never seen him acting that tired me neither Unlike me, Roita is attentive and careful. If he sees it too, it can't be just my imagination. <laughs> Maybe he's been staying up late, working on the next issue? Oh boy, another cup of bitter tea. Here we go. Nope. So not okay. Even if Choco... Has a tier three, so oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. One week later. Wow. <laughs> what an oversleeping wow. I'm late for the Sunday morning program. At least I can catch the second half of pre pre pretty core. Even though we know it's pretty cure. <laughs> Pretty core. Open my hotel. <laughs> A single flower blooming in the asphalt road. Core gray. A single flower swaying in the exalt. Excuse me. Core light gray. Okay. A single flower shredded by the BB guns ray. Excuse me. He saw me say, Corgi, I'll send you a tier 3. I'm open to anyone who comes first. Oh my god. I swear, Luna. <laughs> Core dark gray. Why is it all gray? <laughs> Hato cat pretty core. So cute, so cute. I've o <laughs> it's always good once all three of them are in the fight. And the transformation seems so pretty. That was fun. So much fun, I almost forgot that today is a makeup day. I'm awake and alive now. So it's time to go to school like a good girl. Send me love, please. <laughs> oh my god, Luna. <laughs> OMG, the wrong emote sent. <laughs> oh my god, Luna, I swear. Am I gonna have to bonk you? Have a corgi. <laughs> have a corgi. Hmm. A rather familiar looking bird has collapsed at the foot of the stairs. Angha, are you okay? Did you slip? Are you a dojiko now? I have no idea what that is. My Japanese is not that great. I don't know. Are you alright? 
Did you sprain your ankle? Can birds sprain their ankles? Do they have ankles? Only <laughs> if it's you, of course. Corgi won't bonk me. <laughs> Cause Corgi is just you in disguise. She ignores some messages and I noticed Yes. I noticed that too. Corgis can't reach that. <laughs> Blood, my crimson breast. It craves blood. Be silent. Is he anemic? And how? You're white as a sheet. Let's go to the infirmary. She can't, and Choco can't. <laughs> oh my god. A whole 80 degrees. Oh my god. Angha has fainted completely by the time we arrive. He usually starts ranting about demon spores or something if he gets too close to the infirmary. So maybe it's better that he's out for now. Choco can. <laughs> so I brought him here. Is the doctor gone? Yes, he oversees for... Oh, he's overseas for a week during research, huh? So we don't have to deal with a creepy doctor then. And I'm watching the shop while he's out. Is it really a shop? If it's an infirmary. <laughs> Merry Christmas! The boys seem a little sluggish today. January is almost over after all. I think they start winding down pretty soon after Christmas. Merry Christmas! Actually, are they boys? I hadn't really wondered about their gender before. Just what are they? Um, could you take a look at Enghao then? All I want is that acceptance like Kanji and Choco is making it a challenge like the game. I like, oh my god. Isn't this just low blood pressure? It does look that way. Which isn't to say it couldn't be dangerous. Let's let him rest for a while. Thank you for bringing him here, Monami. I'll be here when he wakes up. Thank you, Yuya. I, s I swear, Luna. I swear. He's been going to see that magazine editor all month. He said he was going for... Ordeals to show the way in times that must come. Deciding on a pen name, but why is he so weak all of a sudden? I'm really worried. Maybe I'll talk to Mr. Naki about it. Oh my god. She knows and lets it be until she's ready. I'll be here for. Oh my god. Hmm. That is a little worrying. I know, he's busy working on manuscripts, but I feel like it's still strange for him to be so weak. He was really energetic even when things were hectic before the convention. I can't believe he gets so trained so quickly. This school does encourage independence in students, and I don't like to interfere with someone who's working hard on something, but... What did you think of that golden pheasant book? Mr. Bishiki Koji? Mr. Nishiki Koji, yes. He even remembers his name. Amazing. I only met him the once, at the snowbound battlefield. But my tribal instincts are telling me he's too dangerous to let out of sight. Okay, well, the Tori about it later. <laughs> I'll just keep going. Oh my god. My quail instincts are telling me the same thing. Hmm. Do you think you can go with Hikure next time? He goes to the company, Boko. I suggested that to Angel, but he said it was something he had to face alone. But I can't just leave this as it stands. Yes, she wants 
it to, oh my god. <laughs> I'll go undercover and tail him. Mm. Just like in a detective movie. Let me know if anything. Oh, our teacher fell asleep again. It's been so long. By my title as the Apostle of the Blue Sky, Edo Blau, I shall courageously tail Ang Hao into the Golden Weekly Headquarters and conduct investigations of the most covert nature. Oh, if you're screaming like that, no you ain't. I'm sorry, but you know, it's in me and comes out of me. Oh my god. The building is right across from here, so there's no way I'll miss him as he's going in. Oh, there he is. Angel enters the building, a massive vanilla envelope under his wing. Is that full of a comic page? Time to go in after him. Mm. This building is actually the secret base of an eagle... Uh, can I English today? Evil organization. I don't think that's how that's supposed to look. Hatofu is full of it. Mmm. <laughs> Jeez. Is what I would say if it were, however, it looks perfectly normal. There are a few birds walking around inside, but nothing suspicious. I can't imagine Mr. Nishiki Koji fitting into such a completely ordinary looking company, really. Never mind a sore thumb. He must stick out like a s thumb that's been nearly lost in a freak <laughs> what is this sentence? Machining accident and is now attached through elaborate bandaging in a last ditch effort to save it. Okay. Yep, he stands up. Hello, I'm so glad you can make it today. I've been waiting for you. Indeed, it is time for us to carve out a new creation under the auspicious of the spirit of reason. Golden Winged Messenger. Yes, yes, of course. Let us engage in creative acts fueled by the finest substances of our imagination. I have secured a special room for our meeting today as well. This way, if you please. The incredibly suspicious golden pheasant and the similarly suspicious bleeding heart dove disappear into a door at the end of the excessively ordinary hallway. Their conversation just now didn't sound at all suspicious, but my danger senses is tingling after them. Again, if, if you scream, it's not very covert. That's what, <laughs> that's what Chuck, re really, 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 uh, really. This is the room. Hmm? There's a light on above the door. It says... This is a publisher's office, right? Not a hospital? What? No one answers me. In any case, Angel's in danger. Enough sneaking. It's time for action. Loud ones. Coming through. In the very unmeeting room like room are Angel unconscious and what is it now? The operation is in progress. Didn't you see the sign outside? Really? I'm eating right now and she won't tell you that you oh my god. The flashy pheasant drawing blood from him. What are you doing? You're not drawing any manga at all. You're just drawing blood. We are in the midst of a grand creative act. A beautiful artwork fashioned of his blood and mind. Saying creepy stuff like that while draining away some birdie's lifeblood is an awful lot like a certain fluffy heretic. Release him. Now. 
or I'll take him here by force. Here comes the 13th floor. You're you're get you're getting that floor soon. If you keep acting the way you are. Oh my, how gallant. Would you be his sweetheart, man? No. We two are linked by the karma of our previous lives, a disaster of the soul. Hmm. I see. Your worldview is every bit as unique as his. Birds of a feather, eh? I had thought your face was familiar. We have met before, yes? So you will be taking him home then? Hmm. And if I were to say no? I think I can't do anything because I'm just a human girl. Do you plenty of people have regretted that before you? Take this. Oh boy, we're actually, we're actually doing attack names here. Acrobatic Starlight Kit. <laughs> well, I'm eating and you know, if I'm eating something, I move up and floor. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. You, you are going to the 13th floor. That floor is made already. You are now on the 13th floor, Luna. I swear by the end of this year that this this morning tale is going to just have a hundred floors. Because of Luna. And just Luna. <laughs> oh my. Isn't that dangerous? You've knocked a hole in the floor, young lady. I rather think the direct hint might leave my beautiful movement to gracefully spin. He dodged it? He is in better shape than the aforementioned fluffy heretic. I feel no artistry in you, but your physical ability holds value. I'm making more than <laughs> it should be. Oh my god. So it's all for you to take pride in that. <laughs> it is beautiful. Thus the flamboyant heretic happily praises me. Oh stop, I'll blush. Wait, no. I am Toko of Saint Pigeon Nation. I will defeat you and bring my classmate back with me. Gallant indeed. Prepare yourself for the end, Mr. B. Oh boy, we're, we're jacking up his name again. Bishiki Koji. Did you just call me Bishiki Koji? Did I? Maybe I did. Jeez, between you and Mr. Nanaki, a girl just can't get away with a little slip of the tongue around here. I might. I bet you do. <laughs> and I believe this is the second time you have done so. Is it not? Mr. Bishiki Koji. Wait, no, I mean Mr. Nishiki Koji. Cheerful tone of voice is suddenly gone. His words now barely audible. But if I really wanted to be sent to the final floor, I would be there in per- Oh my god. Girl didn't even defend herself. When Cheska was there. Who? Huh? Nani? <laughs> what now? Who? <laughs> this must be what they call the calm before the storm. You are still a child, so perhaps you do not know. Do you understand what a serious offense it is to misspeak someone's name? In my own stream, you missed someone hitting on me. Oh my god. I was probably getting food. <laughs> Particularly my name. My name is special. Because I am special. It is the only name of its kind. Nishiki Koji. Tori. This is the worst affront imaginable. Did I not tell you 
I would make you wish you had never crawled your miserable way into this world if you misspoke it again. She was getting food and not the snack in front of her. her. I see. Oh my god. Oh my god. A flash fills the room as he shouts. What? What's happening? Whoa, the room's all messed up. What did he do that for? Good thing I got Angel and got out of the way. I could have been vaporized. Thunder? That can't be it. Some sort of laser weapon. I would rather you did not think of it as some lowly laser beam. <laughs> Nishiki Koji Masterpiece X768 Optical Ordnance Imaginal Ray. But I'll keep myself available because I'm a sleut unto taken. Oh my god. It is the ultimate weapon, utilizing young Hagure's unique physical properties. Is it not beautiful? Angel's physical properties. He must be talking about that. That thing where he draws other people into his fantasies when he gets excited. Oh. There are two birds attached to the laser. What is this? This must violate some sort of basic avian right. I suppose this is the race first introduction. Very well. I shall explain. The pheasant inflates his chest and begins his lecture. Choco has those unique properties. Oh my gosh, Luna. <laughs> oh gosh. He was angry up until a minute ago, but now that he's talking about his creation, he seems pretty happy. Is his personality that simple? The factor behind Hugari's ability to draw those around him into mass hallucinations is abundant in his blood. In other words, with his blood, anyone can have the same power. And so, it came to me to try to in intensify an already powerful fancy and converting it into energy for a weapon most doomless. Um, why am I shivering? What people on this earth have the least love for in the world and live for their fancies the most. Where can I find them? My research was long and arduous. But then I found the answer. Keep in touch with my- oh my god. The very best candidates were at Tokyo Big Sight. That- that's too cruel. How could you use a couple of harmless otaku as weapons to our others? Cruel? Whatever do you mean? Inconceivable. It cannot be. How can they not rejoice at becoming part of my beautiful creation? They are like confused paints to which I have added scheme sense. Artistry. Is it not wonderful? Pretty core so moe. <laughs> core like gray so moe. That sounds like disgusting paint. Wait, I think this is the first time I've seen Otaku who say moe in real life. This weapon is useless. What good is it going to do now? We're not at war. Release those otaku. Useless. Oh no. It has a purpose. A very important one. I'm going to use this weapon to destroy your school. What? I'm going to do some real good. <laughs> More specifically, what lies beneath your school? And one bird there in particular. The purpose is horny ch- oh my god. 
Wait, what did we do? Is this revenge for your dead parents? No. No, it is revenge. For me. Or perhaps I should call it a settlement. So, it's a personal grudge then. Is that it? I don't know what's going on, but I can't just stand by now that I've heard this. I'll stop you here and now. I like to see you try. I can't get close. I'm talking. Uh, English is killing me today. Otaku truly have amazing imaginations. I can see no limits to their use. I can't fight very well while carrying Anghao either. I think I might have to pull out for now. Well, you know Luna's gonna say something about that one. <laughs> I will stop you, Mr. Nishiki Koji. I will. Please, do try. I hope you can come up with something by tomorrow. I have already gotten all the blood I need for Higure. None can stand in the path of my artistry now. Maybe. <laughs> and so I recovered Anghao and fled from the Golden Weekly headquarters. Crazy dream, huh? It was a dream. Nope, just kidding. It remains a troubling reality. Jeez. Don't confuse me like that. Hmm. It looks like this is more serious than we thought. Please do try. It's something I wish I could say to Chuck. Oh my god. I don't think any birdie would have expected to find an operation room and a giant laser in the publisher building. I'm just glad you and Enghao are okay, Choco. Forgive me. To think that my cursed blood now powers the light of dark judgment. Why would you be donating blood at a publisher anyway? Did you notice what was happening, Enghao? No. My consciousness wandered into the great void. In other words, he go to the meeting, be stunned, have blood taken, and then go home feeling dazed and anemic. This combo is great. Choco instead says to me, I can't, Luna. I can't, Luna. I can't with you right now. I just can't. <laughs> That's too much. How did he not notice? Mr. Nishiki Koji said, I would have to come up with something by tomorrow. I think that's when he's planning to attack. The laser at the office blasted through the floor. It was about as powerful as my starlight kick. He probably has a more powerful version prepared if he's hoping to destroy the school. That seems likely. Too much more like just in the- oh my god. I can't with you. I tried calling the police, but they wouldn't take me seriously at all. Ah, calling up and saying, Excuse me, officer, but there's a comic book editor and he wants to blow up my school with a giant laser. Probably wouldn't get more than the immediate disconnection. I guess we'll have to defend the school ourselves. It looks like it. Let's have some tea and think about it. I'll think I'll have peach tea. I would like melon soda. I would like the pulsating blood blessed by the earth and sky blood orange juice. So you want blood orange. You three are awfully relaxed. Who is Mr. Nishiki Koji trying to get revenge on anyway? Since he's targeting the school, it must be a student or teacher here, but... So you got another proposal accepted, huh? The second division sure is impressive. <laughs> Naturally. We're talking about me here, after all. 
I feel terrible for all the biologists here having to work under an empty-headed bird like you. I can't see any reason why the biologists here would need pity from you. What's that? Who is he? One of yours? Oh! Is this the first time you two have met? This is our newest friend, Isa Soma. Come on, Isa. Say hello to Nishiki Koji. I am Isa. A useless leader and researchers who don't even know how to greet their betters. The future of the biology division is the bleakest thing I have ever seen. What are you talking about, Isa? This is great. He'll probably be the department head someday. I bet you two would get along just fine. I don't think Soma agrees with you. Again? My results cannot be inferior to his. This is a dream. Just a bad dream. Isa Soma. I can never claim the spotlight as long as he is here. But I must be the best. I have already decided I must. I was worried about that feral, but he was no trouble. Our spheres of research never overlapped. Nothing good has come of Issa's taking over the division. My beautiful, glorious second optical weapons division. How can its name be so trod into the ground? Issa's origins are a mystery. Something is definitely not right here. The value they place in him must be a mistake. Only his proposals ever got accepted. My talents will rot in this shadow. This tragedy reeks of deceit and intrigue. I have no wish for depravity and decay. I shall gladly leave. The next day, today is Mr. Nishiki Koji's silly destroy Saint Pigeon Nation with a giant laser day. We have to protect our school. Oh, it's Yuya. Salutations, Monami. This is Sakazaki. I'm in front of the Golden Weekly HQ. Over. Report situation. Everything's as you predicted. There's a giant laser inside the building. I'm in Korga's dream now, and she's like, you didn't miss much. <laughs> oh my god. I know I always miss a lot with you, Choco. Oh my god. <laughs> it's installed on the roof, and I think they're adjusting the aim. Take a look at the telescope. They're preparing already. Where I put the telescope. Failure to act with speed in such a situation is. Here, use this. Thank you. You're always so well prepared, Sophia. Let's see the building should be over. It's huge. It appears to be charging up. What is wrong with Japan's public security forces? Why is he able to have a weapon like that? My thoughts are that way. Given the size, I knew it. He's got even more old Taku hooked up than the two I saw yesterday. This is too much. If he turns the fantasies and delusions of that many otaku into power for a weapon, it might just be unstoppable. We could be obliterated at any moment. What are situations like this called again? Attention or die? Emergency. Yes, those. Can't you even remember basic English terminology? Humans, I swear. Anyway, we need to prepare. Aren't you on defense? Leave observation to me and return to your situa- your station? Ugh, English. Yes, sir. Why am I being bossed around by a bird? Hi. Why don't I just see the laser apart? That's right. 
I have the extremely important job of defending from whatever attack comes our way. Oh, joy. So I have to defend against a giant ass laser. This is a real battle. If we fail, the school burns. My blood is boiling already. Ah, Boko, we were waiting for you. Hurry, we need to get ready. Sorry to keep you waiting. That sounds like Choco in my stream. I defend against it. Oh my god. I can't. The hour of judgment draws near. We must disrupt the light of dark judgment with arcane waves. And how Roita. Mr. Nanaki and I are on defense. Time for Operation Pretty Core Shield. Fight fire with fire and hallucinogenic Filipino dove powers. Will hallucinogenic Filipino dove powers? <laughs> if Mr. Nishiki Koji can power his weapon with Angel's ability, we can fight him off with those same abilities. If we try hard enough and believe in each other, Angel's powers can make us all into magical girls. Oh dear lord. Aritza is core gray. Majimaki is core light gray. I'm core dark gray. And Anghao is the fairy who granted the pretty cute girls their mighty powers. Cart caught. With the four of us together, we can raise a pretty core barrier to protect the school from Mr. Nishiki Koji's nefarious plans. It it's literally just pretty <laughs> Are we really going to save a school with a joke like this? This isn't a joke. This is pretty core. Cool. I'm not sure, Boko. Would a pretty core cool shout like that? I shall invoke the defensive rights of old, shiny, pretty core cool field. Angel's giving it his all. We just have to believe in each other, okay? Okay, we can do this. I swear. Ah, oh, an excellent day. Hardly a cloud obscured Japan's lovely face. In every corner and recess of Little Dove City, is laid bare before me. The ghosts of the past which have pained me these long years. That damnable partridge who was always in my way. And the institution which let my genius wither. It is time to say farewell to them all. They sure can do it. All about team effort. Oh my god. I shall wash them clean away, and then it will be time to step into a brand new world of imagination. Choco, give me that team effort. Oh my god, Luna. As the sun rises above anew, Chief Editor, sir, should we set the deadline for this year's new face award to the end of March, like last year? Oh, um, yes. Also, we've got Taka- Ah, also we have Takakishi Po doing the announcement cut, so make sure to follow up with him. Got it, thanks, sir. Where was I again? Um, anyway. This is not only revenge, this is a ceremony. Which I must undergo to usher in my new self. Tremble, Philistines. Be awed by the artistry of my beautiful creation. It's just a laser cannon. I'll accept an apology in the next world, Issa Soma. It's starting, it's starting. Come on now. <laughs> Life of magic and hope that twists throughout this world. Grant the chosen ones the power to defend this land. Pretty core, open my hot <laughs> Oh my god, this is it. A single flower blooming in the asphalt road. Core gray. A single flower swaying in the exhaust fumes. Core light gray. Yellow. A single flower. I remember this shit. You had a BB gun reference in there. Shredded by the BB gun's rage. Core dark gray. <laughs> How would you feel if pigeons did this? <laughs> I I don't I don't know. I, I just I don't know. We want to become seniors here and graduate. 
We won't let you destroy our school. I just finished grading the proficiency tests and it was a lot of work. Couldn't you at least wait until after I've returned them? Um, I don't really want to think about how I did on my proficiency test, so I guess even if the school gets destroyed, it wouldn't be all of that. You must not let your heart waver, although but he has a freaking heart on his forehead. <laughs> I can't with this. <laughs> right. I'm scared about my test, but it would be worse to let our school be blown away. Mr. Nishiki Koji, your plot ends here. Pretty core barrier. It's holding, we can do it. We can save the school. Oh my god. Hmm. I see. You recover remarkably quickly, Higari Ango. Or perhaps you remain able to manifest illusions even when weakened. Your plot is done. Slaps cheeks. Oh my god. But did you really think I didn't have a backup plan? Prepare to trigger the fangirls. Oh no. Are you gonna use Fujoshis now? Are you gonna use Fujoshis? <laughs> Something's happening, Boko. What is it? He's adding power. The second attack will come soon. Oh, yep, they're using Fujoshis. Those are Yaoi books. NBL books. Soon the day racing love dove uke moe oh my god <laughs> they're literally reading bl i can't <laughs> semi pink pelican moe oh my god the first wave was just a raging shot i've got more than just moe loving pigs after all i have heard that the fantasy of fangirls Far surpass those of any fanboy. Watch and be destroyed. Hurry, <laughs> we need to block it. It's too much, core dark gray. <laughs> we do seem to be getting squeezed. <laughs> so my evil half truly does have the power to destroy this world. The first shot was just a test, the next round will make you Oh my god. We can't give up. We have to defend the school. We're the only ones who can. Everything's all sparkly. Oh no. Merry Christmas! <laughs> Merry Christmas! We can't give up yet. We cannot. Merry Christmas! We have to help the pretty cores with our miracle pigeon light. You can do it, pretty cores. Oh my god. I can't. I can't with this. I just- I can't with this. Don't give up. You can do it. You are pretty cool. I can hear everyone cheering us on. Pretty cool are warriors of love. Their kindness makes us stronger. It's very reassuring, isn't it? Hmm. You still resist. Pitiful. Allow me to end it for you. Remove all limiters, outputs to maximum. He's soon the day and noble, so he must be the uke. You dumb newbie, every birdie knows Racing Dove X Tree Sparrow is practically canon. But butlers are so hot. Blackwing Stilt X Pink Pelican is the best. What? What is this? Why is the energy converter becoming so unstable? Your time of judgment has come. You who would have used the blood of the Crimson Angel of Judica to state your greed. Golden winged messenger. Pure spirits of light gather and strike his golden you. Shining pretty core blood. <laughs> We did it. We did it, Angel. We deflected the otaku laser. Look, the Golden Weekly building is practically destroyed. Core burst, yeah. <laughs> yes, that abominable evil has been checked. 
Hmm. They probably won't be back in business for a little while. Hang on. I oh my god. I wasn't sure we could do it. I'm so glad that school's okay. This was my sin. I should have realized sooner that he meant to harvest my blood for evil. Forgive me. Don't worry about it, huh? All's well that ends well. It was Mr. Nishiki Koji's fault, anyway. It's wrong for an adult to go around tricking high school students like that. Try not to get tricked by any more bad grown-ups, okay? Yes, I shall carve this lesson into my crimson chest. Sage of nightmares. I did not account for this in my calculations. My creation was perfect. It was the materials that failed me. Those fangirls' fantasies were dreadful. No one told me their energies would be so unharmonious. Well, yeah, everyone has a ship. <laughs> no one's gonna ship the same thing all the time. I wouldn't have broken down if it weren't for those fangirls. Well, your mistake was using Fujoshis. That was your mistake. <laughs> hmm. Oh well. No doubt he saw the power of my artistry. This was a declaration of war. Golden Weekly, Chief Editor Nishiki Koji, Tori speaking. Ah, Mr. Nishiki Koji. This was very childish and irresponsible of you, understand? I want you to think about what you've done. Shut up. This isn't over yet. Wow. <laughs> Even his clothes and lines sounded like something a movie villain would say after his evil organization is destroyed. And he has no chance of winning. When did you get him to give you his number? Anyway, it looks like he'll probably retreat for now. Hopefully we won't see him again anytime soon. I guess this means your manga's back to square one, huh? But don't worry, I know you can do it. Be not afraid, Edobra. The star that shines within my soul has not yet lost its luster. You always try your best, so I'm sure you'll debut someday. And I'll be there when you do. Now then. Salutations, mon ami. Good work. Yuya! How do things look over there? I hope no one's killed. Don't worry. The building is badly damaged. But we already extracted everyone who was kidnapped from the big site. We've got it from here. Good work. Thanks, Yuya. Hmm. So even that mongrel can make himself useful once in a while. He has all sorts of shady connections, so he's really nice to have around in situations like this. Looks like everything's settled. Actually... Who was Mr. Nishiki Koji trying to get revenge on? Maybe I'll call him up and ask later. I like having Shady connections. Oh my god. Oh dear. Am I letting myself catch a cold? Perhaps I should have brought an extra sweater. Birds wear sweaters now. Falling Chronicles Absolute Zero Fin. <laughs> Because they're cooler than Sunny Connections template. Oh my god. That's a dad joke. There's no other way to word it. That's a dad joke. Luna, go in the corner and bonk yourself twice.